lights on it. Mm. Thing like that. I've never done it, but it actually. I don't know, man. I don't know. Uh, I'll sound check. I'll get the music playing. <laughs> See, if you stay up high, you can't crash because you won't hit the ground. <laughs> It'll hit something else. <laughs> no, just stay up high. You Man, it just it stays right where that's, you left that's it. That's what I'm saying. It's just fine. I mean, I always, I, it was climbing with, you know, with my thumbs off the stick. Stand here. At any point, I feel like you're going to stand over. Stand over. Thank you. I'm just going to do freaking circles, man. That's all you got to do. <laughs> this time, we didn't even range check it. Oh, yeah, yeah good call. I always forget to do that. But you, can, you, you can sort of do either. You can either hold it or... Okay, that did come back a little bit. This doesn't have any gyro, does it? No. Okay. No, but it's got that very slight dihedral thing, I think, going on. So it does... I forget to kind of take my thumbs off the sticks, you know, and just let it fly itself. <laughs> I try to remember to do that sometimes. I don't know, do you do that? Um, sometimes. The other people do. Yeah, that's what I was watching your fingers earlier. It seemed like you were on them all the time, making little teeny tiny adjustments. Uh huh. All the time. Always moving. It's just like momentary. A lot of people have is they go, it's just too far. You only need tiny inches. Yeah, especially if you're moving pretty quick. Unless you're flying like smack free and shit. Right. Yeah. Right. I've watched you do that. But when you're just flying like this, you just need teeny tiny inches. Oh my god, that's perfect! No, it wasn't, but you know what? You were right there. If right there you yeah. held it exactly where you were and skimmed the ground for another five or ten feet. Textbook. Been, well, so, but I end. gave it a little up. I bumped it up. When it bounces and still flies after touching down, that means you're landing too fast. So you want to basically fly it down, flare like a foot off of it, and then hold it and hold it and hold it and keep pulling back a little bit, a little bit until it just kind of... Nice job, Paul. Yeah. Yeah. I might, I might go home. I might have to put my timber up for sale. You just need some words of encouragement. And if anybody's watching this video, I got a timber with floats in excellent condition for $149. Nice. <laughs> All right.